Okay guys, welcome back on the desk. Today we are going to be making this fabulous, super cute embellishment. I am obsessed with gold and I love gold and pink together. I have used my um, April VIP digital papers, but I'm going to explain everything in just a minute. This is so easy to make and you can make them with anything that you have in, in your stash. You don't have to use metallic if you don't, if you're not a fan of it, but I love, love, love metallic. So keep watching guys and I will see you very soon. Okay guys, so let me show you the three digital papers that vip members will receive this month and there is an extra little treat like an extra yeah an extra gift <laughs> from me i'll show you everything in a minute so let's start let's crack on the first kit it's this one it's very shabby it's very romantic it's called shabby shades of pink when i designed um the kit for the vip members of course um I tend to have three different, very different paper packs. So I offer, always offer a variety. So the first one is, yeah, shab Shabby Shades of Pink. So the first page is um, a lovely collection of tags full of flowers and then two pockets. So you simply fussy cut that and you can insert the tags in there. You can use other ephemera, you can print this back to front, um, so you can have it double-sided. I will probably do a separate video when I'll show you what to play with this. Then there is a lovely shabby pinky background. This is more your traditional um, beigey, pinkish background there. And on camera it might look green, but on real life it's a very creamy kind of like an ice cream vanilla color it's more yeah it's like a vanilla if you compare this color with the white it's more creamy than it is then another page we got a um scallop envelope and then two normal size rectangular envelopes so i left one plain so you guys could do everything you want and one's got some flowers and then the last page of the kit which is my favorite one we got some embellishments Okay, so we've got um, some butterflies, some coins, some clocks. I put some um, jug with some flowers. It's very, yeah, everything is very shabby. <laughs> it's very cute. Definitely do a video with that. The second kit is called Tales from Asia. You can see in a minute why. So first page is this one here. Oops, all the way around. I'm trying, no. Yes, yes, it's like this. So we got a cherry blossom, a lantern, and some um, other rectangular pictures in there. Absolutely love this. This will work as a journal cover. If you fold this in a half, or you can just simply fussy cut it, or fussy cut this, or this, and make some cards. Loads and loads of options. Second page is this one. It's more like, um, this is very vintagey, dreamy, shabby this is more cartoony if it makes sense and i love 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 the contrast between turquoise or baby blue and pink i think it works really well another page page number three when we got um again i don't really know what you see on camera but it's a background with pink um clouds and then some lanterns we've got a black and white page here i thought you guys can either color it or fussy cut every um every element or you can just use it as it is you can either do some painting paper on top or you can stamp you can either use your jelly print and color it on top lots of opportunities and then another page when we got some tags using the lanterns okay so this is tales from asia kit number three it's called Equestrian Dream, and it's probably my favourite out of the three. You got um, one page with this lovely horse. I was on the inspiration about this kit. I was on Instagram, and I saw a lady. There's nothing to do with craft. A lady. She was doing like a table prepping for Easter, and then she. I saw her printing uh, something from um, internet. So she printed on this paper, on an A4 paper. It was like a all the Easter pattern. And then she laminated 
and she was as a, as a placemat for a table and I thought how clever is that so I thought you guys can print this laminate it use it as a placemat for your table <laughs> you don't have to do that but just a thought <laughs> Then we got another page. So the colour palette here are this lovely baby blue and violet. Um, and then there's a lot of green and scenery. So this is a, a page with four different backgrounds. Those two are the same, but uh, scaling it in a different way. Uh, you can make cards. You can use it as a background element. You can either stitch it on the top. This can make, if you make handmade leather, thought leather, this will look really nice. Another page with the, of course, the horse there with the stable and a really lovely picturesque. Again, I've done it, I left it white so you guys can either paint and colour it, use it as it is, fold it in a half or stamp on top of it. And then the last page of the kit is that lovely um, embellishment. So again, a lot of you can do hidden paper clips, you can do uh, ATC coins, lots of opportunities. And then the treat from me to you guys VIP members is this one here okay so it's a page when we have film strips I've done a video a while ago using my film strip die in case you guys missed it I will put it at the end of the video um, I got this from eBay it's very very um, old um, it's very versatile because this can be when you when you die cut I can snip this off and I can make this strip as long as I want Okay, but left leaving this at the end, it will cut it off. Okay, so this can continue. So this strip can be very, very long. Okay, so as you can see there, there is not a cut like there is there. Okay, got this from eBay. Don't ask me where. Um, it's just it's just was on eBay. Uh, it's not branded. It's just very, very cheap. Okay, so this one here. It's a film strip. Okay, so this is my website. <laughs> it's easy for me to do this around trying to explain. So if you click on VIP lounge, this is the page that you see. Okay, so how does it work? So you've got three different tiers, three different memberships. One is called Pink Butterfly. So with £3 a month, which is less than the price of a coffee, we have get 10% discount across all my digital papers. You get one of these collections that I showed you, one, and then a month free special offer or a gift. Okay. With the blue butterfly every month, the price is four pound. So you get 20% discount across everything on my website, all my digital papers. You get two mini digital papers, all these pack. So with the, the three pound, you get one. With the four pound, you get two and a monthly special offer with the five pound with the gold butterfly it costs you five pound a month which is the price of a coffee you get 30 percent discount across all my digital you get the three all three collections so you you will get the shabby shadow pink the tales from asia and the equestrian dream and of course my little gift which is the vintage film strip you get a monthly offer you get a fine art print that I will print and deliver to your home address completely free of charge is my treat and then of course you get a video tutorial which is a video that I film specifically for the VIP guys when I do um, different projects showcasing the papers so the feedback on this has been amazing I know you guys much prefer the monthly offer rather than the full year uh, but if you prefer just pay a full year up front so you book one payment which is valid for 12 months I can do that just simply um, simply leave them a comment or send me an email and we will sort that out okay okay so with the gold butterfly which is the five pound a month you get a special video with projects and tutorials so this month we've made together this faceted gift box with a magnet closure so it's got a magnet enclosure so it's all magnetic so it's shut and then the front has got this lovely banner tag and then it's all faceted you see this is the back of course so you've got this lovely lovely shape it looks complicated but it's actually very 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 easy to make it's got a beautiful banner there and then it's got a decorated lead lead too and you get my template on your email as well okay okay guys so let's crack on i'm going to use 
<laughs> if you watch me for a while, you probably know how addicted I am to this cutting die here. It's from Stampin' Up. It's a very old one. It's called Beautiful Pom Prom Promenade or something like that. It's coming on a set. And then today I'm using the... Everything is rosy. <clears throat> I'm using the dies. I'm not using the stamps. I got this from eBay from a lovely lady that she was selling the stamps. So the stamp set, you just got the sheet with the all the flowers. But I've actually used um, put them in there. all these leaves here. I, I have used that one, that one, that one, and that one. So you get two small ones and two slightly large one. The beauty of this is, and I don't know if it's been done intentionally, when you cut them, they're slightly curved. So you see, they're not straight. Can you see that there is a bit of a curve? It's the same on here. So they they form like a little reef, which I think is really, really nice. Um, you can stamp and cut all the flowers as well, which, I'm probably going to do it in another video, but um, yeah, no. So when I, when you joined, um, when you joined my VIP member, if you joined the Gold Butterfly, as I said in the beginning of the video, when you join the Gold Butterfly, you get um, a video tutorial once a month. So this month I've done um, a faceted gift box. Um, it's a very strong box, it's lidded and there is um, a magnet enclosure. Can you see? Can you hear it shut? So it stays like that. There is decorated lid and then there is this, um, these tags that are hanged from the lid. And I, when I was doing it, I said, like, actually, I want to do another video when I'm going to decorate and make this as an embellishment. And part of the video tutorial that you get once a month um, the guys have received the uh, template to make the box as well. So if you wish to join, all links are down below. So what I thought we'll do, but I don't know if it's going to work because I had an idea in my head. I want to use them as a base, cut the embellishment and put this on top. And then I have, so these ones are uh, the pink one which is the same card stock as that all this is shiny gold love that love gold and pink together i'm addicted to that and then are they all gold oh, okay and then i have few scraps of this gold come on focus on me don't focus on the background yeah um this gold uh what you call it metallic glittery paper but I, I literally had a, a square like this. Um, so I thought, let me cut it. And I also have had, because it's gone now, <laughs> uh, a shiny piece of metallic, which is slightly purpley. Because if I put this together, can you see the difference? One is pink, one is purple. But again, it wasn't a lot. So I thought, let me die cut it. I might not use it, I might do. Now I'm conscious that if I do this on top of that, you won't see it. So... Let me, I'm going to use a page from the Shabby Shades of Pink. I'm just going to use the page with the embellishment. I'm going to die cut the Fussy Cut 4 and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've got that in there. Am I going to use some lace? But I don't know if lace works with gold. Hmm, I think so. Yeah, I think it does actually. Happily surprised. Yeah, I think I'm going to chop this in a half so at least i can make two uses of that so um we're just gonna layer them so i want these to be raised up so i'm going to use um my foam pads and i think i'm going to have one there and uh, where is my I'm gonna be naughty and use my best scissors, which you should be doing it. <laughs> Never mind. Right, so I have an idea in my head, but of course, sometimes when you plant something, it don't happen, especially when you film. So this is gonna be. Can you see what I'm doing? So this 
I don't know. I will probably put that one there. And that one there. You see, I don't think you're going to see this gold. And maybe this one on this side. So basically trying to alternate and create like a little reef. Also, what I noticed, I not picked the best one. There was one when, and it was my fault, so nothing to do with the die. When I put it through, I didn't press, I didn't put enough pressure on the What do you guys think? So that's one, but let me try because I have, I think this will work better on I'm going to use the gold leaf, the gold metallic leaf on a pink card stock because I think on a golden gold you can't really see it. I can see it on flesh but I don't think you guys can tell on camera. So I'm going to do, and this is a very like simple, you can use any flowers that you guys have in your stash. I'm gonna make this slightly bigger. And you can make this any color, but because there's a lot of pink, we're gonna use the small one as well. But I'm probably trying to use the metallic, this metallic one. I wish I had more of this pink metallic. And I quite like, that's too big. And that was my worry as well. See, you won't be able to see this more one. Let me hang out there. Yeah, you've got to have a bit of strategic placement with these leaves. Look, there's a lot of gold on the background. But and then what I wanted to try as well, see what you guys think, um, using some uh, lace got my perfectly organized ribbon bag <laughs> oh it's such a mess it's such a mess now i have this lace ribbon but i think it's two different pinks oh no actually i think I'm, it might work let me try <coughs> excuse me this is from stamping up as well and it's called watermelon wonder I had it for a while and want to make like a little um I want this to be like a hanging like a little brush brush is that the word so I put some double side tape on the back Where's my pick and tool? So I want to see the little loop on the top. I think it's probably better if I do that. In fact, can we twist it? Because I do like the idea. Because the ribbon has got that scallop effect. Yeah. I want it a bit more. Sorry, guys. I'm not chatting because I'm concentrating. <laughs> okay. 
so I need something on top here. I'm gonna put a little double side tape. I didn't realize that the lace is very thin. So it needs, come on, cooperate. You're trying to do it this way. Yeah. Done, done. Oh, yeah. Stay there. And then we're going to do the same. So we're going to put some flowers. You can either layer. In fact, let's do that. Let's try. Let me try to layer the gold embellishment. You see, that wasn't planned. <laughs> it just happened now. And also, guys, I love metallic. Absolutely love metallic. But I'm going to offset it. So, there. Oh, yeah, that's pretty. Got loads of layers. And then I think this might be... No, oh, I think it's going to work. Right, so... I'm going to position now the all the embellishment. Now because that is going to cover it, because it's, it, this is very, very big. Um, I want to try actually, I might do, I mean, I'm not doing now, but I will probably do another video with a similar technique. We're using silver, maybe silver and baby blue. You see, I'm worried that if I, so I'm going to put that one there first. See, if I put this on top, I oh know you will be able to see it. Mm, ish. <laughs> Not a lot, but you will. I'm going to stay quite out because this is very big. So just yeah just form like a little reef this small ones you might not be able to see it i got i got a feeling that this one is going to cover them oh no just 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 am i in fact let's have a little piece there and then i'm going to attach Yes, yes, yes. And then we're going to put that one. I want to use them all up anyway, so. I put one on this side as well. And then position. Should we trim? I think I'm going to trim this. I like it, but for this project, maybe not. Oh, yeah, that's so much better. Right, let's have a look. Let's bring them all together. What do you guys think? This has been more simpler than this one here with the lace. And that's probably my favorite. This will be amazing um, present topper. Okay, right guys, that is it. If you wish to join and you receive the three kits or the two kits or one kit, follow the link down below. You can stop the membership anytime you want. Um, but yeah, so you get one kit, two kits, three kits. And then with a five pound, you get a fine art print to deliver to your home address. Again, my treat, free delivery, and then the video tutorial as well. Okay, guys, I hope you like this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a really big, huge thumbs up. It really helps with my journey here on YouTube. Just a reminder, guys, that on April, throughout the full month, 
from the 1st of April to the 31st or 30th, I think it's 30th, um, I have a sale on my website because April is the month of my birthday, it's the month of my channel's birthday, and also it's the month of my business birthday. So I've got three big birthdays throughout the full month. So it's a way for me um, to say thank you to every single one of you. So yeah, just go to my website and have a look and treat yourself. I will put another, um, another video here on the screen guys so if you wish to carry on watching for um, uh, more ideas and inspiration please feel free to do so and i will see you in the next video bye